Greetings, Lords of the Fallen Guru here. And today what we will do is show you how to easily kill Pieta, she of blessed renewal, with your balls hanging out too. The key to this fight is patience, as the Minger has a lot of moves that can daze and confuse you if you lose your cool. So the plan is to stay as close as possible at all times and wait for her to swing at you. The reason for this is because her up-close attacks are easily red, thanks to the long swing she has. So you can easily dodge through them and then deliver a few counter-attacks before she strikes again. You can apply a weapon buff at the start of the fight, such as fire salts for the extra damage, if you want to get the job done quicker. That's all you need to do for phase one. You barely even have to move, as you can just stand still and press the dodge button when she swings, following it up with a few light attacks before you have to dodge again. Repeat this pattern until phase two kicks in, which will happen once she has lost about a quarter of her health. She's a lot more mobile in phase two and will become airborne, so now is a good time to use your ranged attacks, such as the grenades that I'll be throwing in her general area, as she'll spend a lot of time at a distance in phase two. You can use ammunition pouches to replenish your throwables to keep the pressure on her with constant attacks. When you're not damaging her from afar, the tactics from phase one still work, so wait for her to swoop in and swing, allowing you to dodge through it and then counter it with a light attack. The only difference here is that you will only have time to attack her once before she swings again. So get into the habit of pressing dodge, followed by light attack, and then dodge again, as this will be the repeating pattern when she's up close in phase two. She will summon golden visages of herself when she's away from you. But these are easily avoided, so just concentrate on hitting her with your long range attacks until she swoops in, and you'll have no problems at all. If you pay attention and follow my advice, you won't even need your second life. You can do it, the guru has faith in you. And I know what you're thinking, but guru, where is the cheese? Fear not as the cheese will come soon enough, but for now I have to see what the game has to offer. If this is an early access copy, I'm studying it in depth. Subscribe for all things Lords of Fallen, including boss guides, tips, and a rage playthrough for my pale disciple, Frostguard, the Dragon Lord Coward, and no, he's not me, we're two different people. You'll potentially love it. Fuck off. Right on my guy. Fuck this game, I've had enough! And I've just broke my monitor, so I'm done.